Akahaina vai Mo kayakulike Olu olu ka manao In Hawaiian culture, those that came before us are so important. We'll not only talk about us as individuals, we'll talk about the moku ahau of the canoe. In the history of the canoe, you learn about the parts of the canoe. Okay, so I'd like to introduce Kahu Bishaw, who come and he's going to uh, be blessing us here. So Kahu. All right. E malama mai oi. E mamua a e oi. E ho in kaiko mai oi. A blessing upon each and every one. And for those that are the alakai, and the coaches, and the leaders, a special blessing for you. That you will continue to guide and direct with integrity of heart and skillful hands. That you will be a malama and pono in all that you do. Go kamea no ke au puni. A me kamana me ko nani ea mauloa aku. Amen. And for the next generation that Exodus represents, a blessing upon you. Every one of these canoes has a name that tells a story. You know, the, the Lanakila Maulo Kalakahi, this log here was given to us, was sold to us by Uncle Red Kanua from uh, Kaiupua Canoe Club. But this canoe, the log, was taken up to Kamehameha Schools when Uncle Wright Bowman and Wright Jr. were up there and Fred controlling those folks. And our canoe club went up there and worked on this canoe, the entire canoe club. And that's where the name came from. Talk about many hands working together to merge victorious. That's the history of this boat here. But we're people of the sea, so this first oli that I share with you is that it, it's calling on all of our ancestors that have come before us to rise up out of the sea and give us strength. And so the reason why I share that with you is because you have to know that when you're paddling these canoes, there are many that came before you. But every stroke that you take, is you're not taking it alone. You're taking it with the strength of all of those that put time into these canoes, your coaches, Every stroke that you take, that's, who, that's the kuleana and strength that you're carrying with you. Um, and, but I'll tell you this, being around canoe paddling, you go in the ocean, it just rejuvenates you because the ocean causes you to want to be humble, have to be humble. You have to respect it. You learn so much about everything. So I'll start the chants now. So you can just bow your heads. Um. <laughs> Eo mai ki kai mai. O na velu ali a pau i hana i a i ka poe kala i kiku. Eo mai ki kai mai. O na pu ali a pau i hana i a i ka poe kala i kiku. Eo mai ki kai mai. E yawe e ki anu e lulu moku e yawe e lilo e yawe umi. E yawe e uo unu e mahi e yawe e uo ko e lau. E yawe e ka ia. E yawe e ka mahi ni ku e o ka hili o pua. E yawe e ka ono e o ka la. E yawe e ku o mali e yawe e ki lani vahi ni ali o pua na hua kale. Ya <laughs> Ha ko kula na ya hunu ya la na kira ya hadwa ye 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 hadwa ye hadwa ye